Good morning, Robins. Welcome back to my channel. I hope everyone is doing well. It's been a great start to the new year. When I started playing online games or virtual worlds, I had started off playing Sims 2 and then transitioned quickly into IMVU. From IMVU, I found Second Life. But along the way, I made friends, some of which stayed in IMVU some of which transitioned to Second Life with me and some that really couldn't figure out what world. So a friend of mine that I used to play IMVU with about 13 years ago has reached out to me and asked, you know, would I show her how to navigate around Second Life? And she has finally decided to transition from IMVU to Second Life. So I'm all for change, so let's get ready and go pick her up from the airport and welcome her into Second Life. So for my outfit, I got the dress from Rebel Gal and EC Cloth and the jacket from Ison. Shoe is called Arkansas from Essence. For my hairstyle, which I had on earlier with the sleeping mask, is called Latte by Foxy. So my cast guest, Esther, she is going to be staying with me until the end of January. I think that's enough time for her to build up her inventory a bit, learn how to dress her avatar, learn how to navigate through the maps and events, things that we will consider the basic things. So the reason why we agreed until the end of January is because I was speaking to a friend of mine and we discussed how in IMVU, it's so different when you have a home. It's sort of like in your inventory that you can pull out at any time. You don't have to pay any land here or any rent on things that you already own in IMVU. Whereas in Second Life, there is a fee for an apartment or if you're purchasing land. I think it's really important for someone that is new to SL to understand the importance about prim counting and the value of paying a tier. It makes them more appreciative of individuals that open their personal space, their homes to newcomers or even people who are bouncing back into the world of Second Life. Finally made it here. Let's see if her flight made it in. Okay, her flight has landed. Oh, there she is. Hi, hey. Oh, I hope you haven't been waiting too long. And I know you probably are really hungry. Let's go to one of my favorite restaurants and get something to eat. The details on how to create a restaurant just like this will be credited on my website. Guys, that was such a long day, but I'm glad that we got to the airport on time. Maybe just a little bit late, but still on time. And I'm glad that Esther is settled in. I will be sure to keep you guys updated on her progress and just let you know how it was for her and me to help someone in Second Life transition from IMVU. When I started Second Life, there was no help whatsoever, and so it should be a different experience. All items used in this recording will be credited on my website that will be linked in the description below. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon for future notification of my posting. If you like this video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. Also, what do you guys think about the idea of letting newcomers learn the value of prims and the value of paying fear. Do you think it's something that they should learn right away 
or is it something that isn't really important? Thank you guys so much for going to the airport with me. So until next time, bye!